This is Shawn Michaels' first title defense since winning the World Heavyweight Championship at Survivor Series. This match should include Chris Jericho, and it would have if it wasn't for Scott Steiner. I thought you'd bring that up. You've become one big Chris Jericho butt kisser, I gotta tell you. What? They really do a good job of the back of the um, backstory to these matches. Shawn Michaels' face and hair really needs work. Um, they did not do that great of a job. RVD looked just like RVD, but um, Shawn Michaels don't look nothing like Shawn. He did. He beat five other men. Yeah, but you have to admit, Cole, he had an advantage. He didn't have to enter that elimination chamber until very late in the match. He got to sit back and watch a lot of those guys literally beat the hell out of each other. Including Rob Van Dam, who was in that match from the get-go. He's putting those educated feet to good use. You know, I must admit... Okay, we've got a damage Michaels moderate. Rob Van Dam in his prime was so quick, yo. To become world heavyweight champion. Like, he is fast as hell. His punches are quick. His kicks are quick. Actually, no, I spoke too soon because that kick was slow as hell. His kicks are supposed to be quick. Let's put it that way. Struggling for control into the clinch. And here's Rob Van Dam. Shawn Michaels switches it up. All these reversals, man. So unpredictable. Come on, Sean. Why don't you die, dude? I'm just trying to get through this as fast as possible. And you're really making this annoying. This isn't where Rob Van Dam Get off me. Oh, come on. Ladies and gentlemen, this is I know I complain about this in every video, but these reversals are sus. Dudley's to retain the world tag team titles, followed by Victoria successfully retaining her women's championship against... Like, it may sound like I'm just bitching because I'm not good at the game, but I am actually pretty good at these games, and the reversals just suck. Uh oh, rolling thunder! Oh, never mind. Monkey flip. I thought it was going to be a rolling thunder into the turnbuckle. You hear how his leg connected? Rob Van Dam won a triple threat match here live last week to become the number one contender for the World Heavyweight Championship. And Booker T and Chris Jericho were the other two men in that match. And let's not forget Christian and Scott Steiner interjected themselves into the match. It was pure chaos. But when the smoke cleared, it was Rob Van Dam who walked away with tonight's title opportunity. There's the quickness. Ooh, what a hurricane run. Shawn Michaels became WWE's first ever Grand Slam champion when he won the European title back in September 1997. And after winning the World Heavyweight Championship at Survivor Series, we're going to have to come up with a new name. That's five different championships HBK has earned over the course of his WWE career. Shawn Michaels is not liking this. Shawn Michaels has to be protective of his lower back. It'll never be the same following his well-documented back surgery. And undoubtedly, Rob Van Dam must focus on... Oh. Irish put Michaels into the ropes. Bam! Big forearm! Ooh. From HBK. I... And a kip up by Shawn Michaels. Ooh, that Irish whip turned into a kip up. He's going for it. Chin music time! Fuck it. Shawn Michaels. Sweet chin music. And now RBD ducks the sweet chin I was not prepared for that button press, but I got to it anyway. Rolling Thunder. Even though that's not how RVD does it, but whatever. What is my objective? Defeat Shawn Michaels with RVD's top rope finisher. Five star frog splash. All he's got to do is turn HBK over, and this should be it. Here we go. Pin him. Pin him. One, two, Triple H, you son of a bitch. Triple H is here. Look out. Pedigree. On the concrete floor. You son of a bitch. Why, Triple H? Why? <laughs> oh, when JR does shit like that, it never gets old, man. Oh, JR be Kirkin.
Why Triple H? Why? Tell me why, you son of a bitch. Oh, this is not gonna be good. Oh shit. The game with that steel chair in the ring. And look at the way he's eyeing Shawn Michaels. He despises Shawn Michaels. He will not stop at anything until he ends Shawn Michaels' career. Shawn is down and out here. Oh, wait. Mm. Look at this. Michaels fire it back. Big right hands to Triple H. Oh, right back to the midsection for the game. And now the game, hammering away on Michaels. This is turning into a brawl here. Oh, man. Michaels never giving up, King. He's got the heart. He's got the guts. He's got the soul of a champion. Damn, look at him punches. <laughs> Uh-oh. Backdrop. On the chair. When is this gonna end? Somebody get Michaels a chiropractor. That pedigree on the concrete floor was vicious. And that backdrop... Might have been even more vicious on that steel chair. Wow. Shawn Michaels was a special guest referee for the number one contenders match. So am I the referee or am I Triple H? If I'm the referee, that's cool. We skipping. Thinking back, I didn't think Shawn Michaels would ever return to oh. WWE. But he came back at SummerSlam and beat Triple H in a street fight. Yeah. I'm not the referee like I wanted to be. Elimination Chamber and fight for the World Heavyweight Title, but he did, and I didn't think he could win it. I don't understand why the special referee match is not a match that you can select, even though it's in the showcase. But you can't play a special referee match in exhibition mode. I also don't think you can select a three-on-three -three elimination chamber match there's a lot of shit you can't do in the in the um in the exhibition mode that happens to be in the showcase casket match you can't play an exhibition but you're used to in all the old games they just they 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 took away a lot i like the gameplay because it's realistic but at times it's a little too sluggish like if I'm right in front of a dude I should be able to hit him I got enough stamina I'm right in front of the dude I should be able to knock his fucking lights out I can understand that whole running strike shit that they used to uh, what the f that whole running strike shit that they used to do was bullshit how people would just run around and do running grapples or running um, strikes, especially online. That was terrible. If you played this game online in any of the previous years, you went through hell because people would find the cheesiest shit. I don't even play online with this game because I st I found a dude who could just spam the same move over and over, and there was nothing you could do to block it like there was no reversal icon that would come up he would just like kick you like 17 times and then do his finisher and then if you kicked out guess what he'd kick you 17 more times and then do his finisher so yeah that's a lot of shit that needs to be worked on with this game but hopefully um 2k gets this shit right where the fuck is my stamina? And moments later, Batista went on to make quick work of the hurricane. Well, you gotta wonder what Batista could become under I had a lot more stamina in the beginning of this match. The match just started, really. 
A sharp kick. And getting it put on him, Rob Van Dam. Ooh, what a punch. Is going to be impartial here tonight after what Triple H did to him. He Triple H with the cover on Rob Van Dam, and there's Shawn Michaels. And oh, man. Triple H is not going to like that. <laughs> you think that was a little slow? You think? <laughs> the game is living. And now Rob Van Dam is rolling up Triple H. And oh! A really fast count from Shawn Michaels now on the game. Wow. Well, he kind of handed to Shawn Michaels. He's not exactly an impartial referee in this one, is he? Triple H trying to make it to Armageddon and hoping to add to his already impressive resume that includes one World Heavyweight Championship reign and five WWE title reigns. Well, let's not forget the Intercontinental, European, and Tag Team Championships, as well as the King of the Ring and Royal Rumble wins. This is dangerous. This reversals is... You know, it seems as though... I'm going to try to get through my next video. Not this video, because it's already it's already over and done with. But the next video I do on the showcase, I'm not going to complain about reversals at There's a reversal. He whips Triple H into the corner. Ooh. 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 Oh. Oh no! BK. Woo a jumping corner splash. Now what? Triple H. Go for it. Spine Buster. Uh-oh. It might be time to run. You want to kip up? Get back. That was fake as hell. Get back down, RVD. <laughs> Simply devastating. The fuck back now. No. Eric Bischoff came out here and stripped Sean. You getting hit with this chair. I'm sorry. Right now. Oh, come on, King. Why in the world would you say that? What? Michaels hasn't done anything to warrant that happening. Bad officiating, Cole. This is as Come on. Gets. Michaels is obviously for Rob Van Dam. And we're going back between the ropes. Hit him. This game is sus. Did you hear the Thank you. Fuck. Uh. This In his ass. Keep up. Yes. Is he gonna go for it? Oh, boo, boo. Oh, never mind. Well, Triple H may have won this match, but he sure didn't win the fight. That's right. Well, I'm at the 15 minute mark, so I'm HB Fresh. Holla at your boy. I get money. We will continue this epic rivalry at Armageddon in the next video. Two out of three falls. The first fall is a street fight, the second fall is a steel cage. And if it goes to a third fall, we will see a match that Shawn Michaels made famous. A ladder match.
surprisingly showed a sign of support for the new champion. There was a time I knew beyond a shadow of a doubt that I was the man. A kid up on the raft and said, Hey, Nature Boy, you ain't the man anymore. It's Shawn Michaels. Until Flair made clear what his message was really about. There is a new man in town. And Armageddon, the man, the bigger, better version, the best wrestler alive today, Triple H. If you're not ready to pass the torch, he'll kill you. The night was far from over for Triple H and Shawn Michaels as Raw culminated in a brawl no! No! that would set the stage for Armageddon. We're not seeing Shawn Michaels. You're seeing the showstopper right now. Taking out Flair. He's taking out the number one contender. Oh, my God, he's pounding that ladder to the top. No! God, no! Michaels, the elbow on the top of the semi. A clash of colossal proportions as Triple H takes on Shawn Michaels in three stages of hell.